Hey everyone, Ed here, Top of the Line Training. Just doing another video today on the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. Coming up on 1,000 subs, and uh, I thought that I would go ahead and do a little contest to boost it up a little bit, and, uh, or basically, not a contest, really just a giveaway, you know. Um, I did one for uh, 500 subscribers, and I'm uh, going to do one for 1,000. Should have been there a long time ago, but uh, over the past two years, I've moved like four times, maybe five, the hell I don't know. This last one was uh, to a common state of Illinois, and uh, here I am. But I'm getting things rolling, getting, finally getting settled down. It's taking me some time. I'm uh, going to start putting out some videos really hardcore here coming up. Got a lot of things coming, uh, planned and whatnot, so make sure you look out for that. With all that being said, let's talk about the contest. Pretty easy to enter, but here's the prizes. Got a Mike Wallace pup. Now this is not the pup, but this is something like it. Um, this was made for me by Mike Wallace, um, one of a kind. I wanted a neck knife, so he made me one. Um, it's something like the pup, pretty close to it. Uh, real nice knife, guys. Neck knife comes with a it will come with a Yellow Hawk Custom Kydex Sheath Waterman's uh, Knot for adjustability around the neck and whatnot. So, real nice sheath. Um, good size. Oh, get that bitch off. Uh, good size uh, for a neck knife. You can do a lot with this thing. I've, I've demoed it. I uh, did a video on it. Make sure you check it out if you... You're interested. With that being said, this is, in my opinion, the grand prize, if you will. Um, but uh, what I'm going to do is, well, first of all, with the Kydex sheet from Yellow Hawk Custom Kydex. This is a bare sheet, just a sheet. If you want, when you get this, um, if you win, you can go ahead and talk to Doug Wilson. And if you want, you can put on, like say, an example, a ferro rod, maybe a sharpening stone, whatever you want maybe to add on to it. That's your call. That's on you. That's out of your pocket. Basically, what I'm paying for or acquiring is the Yellow Hawk Custom Kydex sheath and the knife. So if you want to have some extras added on to the sheath, uh, you can do so. And I'll give you an example of that in a minute. Uh, with that being said, the knife is what I'm uh, having Mike Wallace make. And what will happen is, after you, if you're the winner, after we make contact and whatnot, I'll have you contact him. And then he'll make the knife for you at his on his time frame, his time schedule, he's a very busy man, uh, making knives galore, and uh, so you'll have to get in line. However, when the end comes, you'll have a Mike Wallace custom knife and a Yellow Hawk custom Kydex sheath. Like I said, you can add, if you want to add something on the sheath, you can do so. Now, with all that being said, what I'm going to do is, as well, um, if you want another knife instead of this knife, you can talk to Mike Wallace and or go on his website, check him out, see what you may want. And I'll give you some examples here in a second. But if you want a different knife, I'll load the money, whatever this cost, I'll take this money or you can take this money and put it towards another knife if that's what you want to do. Same thing with the, uh, uh, the sheet. Uh, so uh, just keep that in mind. So if you win, you can contact them and you can upgrade. You pay the difference. It's up to you. So if you've been wanting a Mike Wallace knife or Yellow Hawk Custom Kydex sheath, there's a little jump start for you. So, and like I said, in my opinion, this is grand prize. To give you some examples, if you haven't seen my video on my Mike Wallace knives. 
I'm just going to show you real quick um, some of the <coughs> knives as well as the accessories you can get from Yellow Hawk Custom Kydex. So this is a uh, uh, Mike Wallace Bowie. Here you go. Beautiful knife. Now this stuff is not cheap by any means. By any means. But it's high, high, high quality, top of the line uh, equipment. And uh, listen to this. That's the Yellow Hawk click. Um, anyway, some of the accessories. I have a diamond home rod or sharpener here. Ferro rod. Uh, small fire kit. It's got a tabby dangler on it. Like I said, um, you can jump start something like this with the winning. Where you end up winning. Uh, the next one, of course, is the Delta Whiskey Bravo Backcountry. Yellow Hot Click. Got my Rick Lindsay Frail Rod in here. Um, and. Uh, but you can get a standard ferro rod like I have over here on this one. Or whatever ferro rod you want to get. If, if here is a condor pouch. I have a Leatherman Surge. That's the only one I ever go with. The Leatherman Surge. Tab Dangler. Full Altoid survival kit on the back. Really nice setup. I got it set up for Bol Baldrick Carry. Um, of course, I can go into the Tab Dangler if needed. Um, so. Uh, same thing with this one here, Baldrick Carry, Tabby Dangle. <coughs> I think, excuse me, um, don't quote me on this one, but I think this one had a lock tech on it as well, but I took it off, I believe. And then the, this one of my favorite knives by Mike Wallace is the Spear One. I have the Nesmic tip on it. Um, beautiful knife, love this knife, really nice. Uh, Doug Wilson did a job on this particular sheath. I've got a sharpener, I've got a six inch ferro rod, so this ferro rod will fit in there. Got a tech lock, got a tabby dangler, it's not Baldrick carry. It's got a full fledged compass on it. It's got a uh, slot here. If I wanted to cut cordage, I could cut it. So, my point to it is <clears throat> if you're interested in one of these knives or any of these knives, you can get a jump start if you if you're a winner. You can get a jump start with this. I'll throw the money on top of this, and you pick you pick up the rest. And uh, I'll see about uh, maybe even throwing in a little bit more for the Yellow Hawk Kydex sheath because I don't think this. I can't remember, but I don't think this is very expensive. Uh, so we'll we'll talk about that later. So that's grand prize. Uh, like I said, this is just an example of. Doug Wilson's work and what you can maybe get if you wanted, as well as um, different knives from uh, Wallace Edge Tools. So, grand prize. Uh, not necessarily in this order. Um, right now I have three prizes. I am working on a couple more. So we'll see how that goes. I'm just waiting on word right now. But right here, we have a uh, VanQuest V-Packer bag, sling bag. It slings over your shoulder like so. Um, I'm not sure if this is a lefty or righty. I think it's a lefty. Yeah, it's all twisted up. So anyway, it's a V-Packer. Got a concealed carry on the back. Got a uh, zipper pouch on the on the flap. Just a quick run through. Got a Velcro uh, slip pocket here. Got another uh, zippered pocket on the front, which has the, this is a really nice feature right here, guys. I can't remember. This is their ladder system, I believe, and you can tape the gear. If you haven't seen my uh, video on uh, the Van Quest, go check it out. It's not the V-Packer, but this is the same, <coughs> excuse me, uh, same uh, setup for this. This is really nice. You can take equipment, primarily med, med gear, latch it in there like so, cinch it down, ain't going nowhere. You have your gauze, your Israeli bandages, whatever you want to put in there, but it's a real nice feature. Got some uh, 
uh, elastic uh, keepers here, and one slip bag with a key keeper for sensitive items, whatever. Double zippered, YKK zipper, Duraflex buckles, top of the line on the Van Quest. Also, you notice the orange interior as well as in the main pouch, you have orange interior. That's just a quick run through. There's a couple slip pockets inside, storm collar, everything like that on this pack. Really nice little pack, guys. Um, got a couple side pouches as well. Um, top grab and handle, sling. Um, I don't know where this is going to fall as far as order of prizes, but it is one, the Van Quest V Packer. So a big shout out to uh, Van Quest Gear. Um, it's uh, tough, tough built gear, and uh, it also has a Velcro here for patches or whatever. Tough built gear, and I own about four VanQuest uh, bags myself. If you haven't seen the video, check them out on my channel. Uh, awesome, very well built stuff. Um, they definitely made Maxpedition and other companies step up their game, no doubt about it. And uh, I'm really excited to be able to give this away for a thousand subscriber giveaway. And I really, again, big shout out to VanQuest. And you can check out all the details of this down in the uh, bottom box below. So make sure you check that out. Another all right, and one of the next prizes is a Baco Lapplander saw. If you know anything about my uh, channel or me, when I go to the woods, I always have one of these with me. Uh, it is worth its weight in gold. It is a powerhouse to a blade. Not so much this neck knight blade, but like say if I had this buoy by Mike Wallace or my other, either any blade, and you have this with you, you've got an awesome set that you can uh, take care of business with in the wood, in the woods. This uh, cut, I don't know what the inch size uh, logs and whatnot will cut, but it's a very powerful tool and uh, easy to carry, lightweight. I can't say enough about them. So that'll be another prize. <coughs> I also have a buck saw, of course, that I carry if I'm I'm going for a longer term. But just say a day hike in the woods or I'm going for a hunt, a day hunt, whatever it may be. I always have a blade and the Baco Laplander with me. Even if I had the uh, Leatherman Surge with me and the Baco, I have a very powerful system. So this really adds to your kit. Uh, and I, I, it really needs no introduction. Michael Lettlander. So those are three of the prizes right here. Let me move these out of the way. These are uh, three of the prizes right here. You got the knife, you got the Baco, and you got the V-Packer by VanQuest. And uh, like I said, I'm working on a couple more uh, prizes. Maybe even, maybe, uh, maybe even a three, third one. So or sixth one, if you will. So that being said. These are the prizes for now. I will do an updated video on this uh, just to let you know the full prize kit. And uh, so let me go into the, uh, what you have to do in order to uh, be in the drawing. Okay, so what will happen is at the bottom of this video, that what you have to do is you have to give me a thumbs up on a video, any video. You have to be a subscriber and you have to make a comment. So in order to do those things, you can do it all right here on this video. You go down, if you're not a subscriber, click that red box, bam, you're a subscriber. As well, drop down to the uh, thumbs up. Click it. And then in the comment, se comment section, box what I want you to write is Ed I'm in that's the only thing I want you to write if you don't if you got any questions or something go ahead and ask as well but primarily Ed I'm in now the one other word that you can add or I want you to add I may do this in a live setting a live drawing and if that's the case what I want you to write is Ed I'm in and then space and the word live so you have two choices basically, add them in or add them in live. 
That's all I need to see. I don't want a bunch of, unless you have a question about something, one of the prizes or whatever have you. I don't want a bunch of comments and all this kind of stuff. Uh, just all I want is those words. I'm just trying to keep it uh, under control because I'm expecting a great number of uh, people to sign up to get these prizes and just be able to keep it under control. What I'll do, say example, Joe Blow sends me a tax ad I'm in. I'll write down example whatever number he is. Say example he's the eighth person to do it. I'll write down number eight, Joe Blow, bam, he's in. So when it comes time for the drawing, what I'll do is I'll reach in something, a bucket, a hat, whatever, that has a uh, you know numbers in it, and I'll pull it out. If Joe Blow's number eight, example, I pull out number eight, number eight, I look on the list, Joe Blow's number eight, Joe Blow wins. Bam. Just like that. I'll do that for all five prizes, possibly six. Um, so other than that, and I will leave the contest or the uh, what you have to do to enter the contest in the uh, space below. So make sure you check it and read it. Um, other than that, though, I can't think of anything to tell you. But like I said, got the knife, got the uh, Baco Laplander, got the V Packer from VanQuest right now. Uh, those are the prizes. And then what I'm going to do as well, example, um, someone if somebody wins. What I'm going to do is, the number one winner, I'll contact them, and then I'm going to ask them what prize they want. Some example, someone might not want the knife or the salt. They want the V-Packer, then that's what they get. Next person, what do they want? Okay, I want the knife. Boom. Okay, next person, salt. So, that's how it's going to go. I'll give you the option from the winner down to pick what prize you want. All right, so let me recap. Again, if you want to be in the contest, in the comment section below, first of all, your subscriber, thumbs up, comment section, Ed, I'm in. If you want to see it, a live drawing, Ed, I'm in, and the word live. That's all I need, unless you have a question about something. Um, I'll come back with a follow-up video on... Uh, what the prizes are and things going on. What I'm planning on doing is as of right now, I'm gonna to go to the uh, to uh, January 31st. January 31st will be the drawing. Whether I reach it, uh, well, I'm gonna I'm not gonna do the drawing until I hit 1,000 subscribers. So with that being said, make sure that you pass this video around, share it, uh, make sure you get the word out, get this video spread, because uh, we gotta have 1,000 subscribers. Uh, hopefully I'll get over a thousand, but uh, I need your help in doing so. So please, uh, you know, share the video, get it out there. All right, this is Ed Top of Line Training, 1,000 sub giveaway. I hope to see you entered, and uh, looking forward to doing the drop.